estamos aquí de nuevo con Dave Duncan, una de las leyendas del skateboard, por no decir la leyenda, hoy por hoy la tenemos aquí en Vigo. So, man, we were talking about the past. We were talking about skateboarding in the 80s. European tours, they were crazy. I started, my first skateboards were steel wheels, serious. Yeah. It was a toy, like you have a yo-yo and a hula hoop, it was a toy. Eventually the clay wheels and the urethane, when they invented urethane, it's like the Dogtown movie. Yeah. You know, we can go to the 80s and 90s, but I got to take you back. It was like a magic carpet ride, like once the urethane came, it changed everyone's life, you know. How was, it's amazing. How was that, beginning of the 70s? In the, in the middle of the 70s, yeah, middle 74 70s. I think was something, but I was a teenager at the time. I skateboarded at school every day on the clay wheels. Yeah. And when the urethane came, we were riding the pools, the banks, it's exactly like the Dogtown movie. Revolution it, 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 to revolution. It brought, it brought me here, you know. As I travel the world for 20 or 30 years, I feel like I'm carrying the torch for Tony Alba, Jay Adams, Shogo Kubo, like all the aggressive skaters I grew up with. You know, that it's probably what skateboarding, like surfing, skating, having fun, living life. Like they, they made me who I am, you know. That's the point. So th right now, what are you doing? Are you are you working for the so World Cup? I, I, I've been a carpenter. I, I, oh, I, really? When, when the skate parks closed in the 70s, yeah. I made ramps for my friends in their backyards and stuff. I, I'm a carpenter. I, I make houses. And so then the, the World Cup Tour said, hey, we need you to make vert ramps for Tony Hawk and all the, the pro tour. Yeah. I've made like over 100 vert ramps, like uh, street cars, like skate parks. So because of that, they're like, oh, you're here. You can be a judge. Can you announce? So I'm always like running the competition. So Always in the industry. Always yeah, yeah, yeah. Industry. It's nice to come to a place like this where the course is perfect. I don't yeah. have to use a hammer or, or, or <laughs> drill or nothing. I just grab the mic and have fun. It's, so, it's, it's like uh, I'm retired. <laughs> In a way, because I spent so many years working really hard. Working you, in you the were the ones sun. who was working. With, yeah, like uh, deadline. You gotta come now. You gotta work all night. We have to be ready for tomorrow. Like, you know, it's it's crazy. So, but I love uh, it's passion for skateboarding. You know, I've had an amazing. You still skating? Yeah, I'm going still, to Venice. Still, yeah, still Benny skating. Skate park, uh, Costa yeah, yeah, Mesa. No, no, everywhere, skating all over the world. Everywhere I go, everywhere I go, I still skateboard. You know, so, but it's it's the passion of of wa watching the young kids. And what's possible, you know, to see the future and to help these guys yeah. have a good time. Like I had a good time. You know what? So, you, you know, know what it happens. What we, the feeling we have in Spain, is like in, in U.S. You have, they have really good respect of legends. It's it's a new thing for, it's for a, a new while. Thing. In, yeah, in, like in the, the 90s, Hall of Fame, Hall of Fame and, thing. Yeah, but listen, in the 90s, Tony Hawk didn't even have a pro model. He, yeah. His birdhouse was almost bankrupt. Like nobody gave gave anything about Tony Hawk. Yeah. Once the X Games came, 95, they brought him back. And after that, then we brought back the legends, Caballero, Let's Mountain, Christian Soy, Dwayne Olson, Peters. Yeah, 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 so yeah, Steve also. So we started this thing of like, hey, these guys are still skating, let's bring them back. Yeah. So it's great now that they have this like master's division. And I try to skate every time there's like something for like the guys 40 and over or whatever, like let's go, let's have fun. And it's cool to see that when we were younger, nobody was older still skating like that. So yeah. it's cool. But, uh, So, you know, it's it's all generations of skateboarding. You know, a lot of guys have their kids, they bring them to the skate park. The man skating with the kids is super cool. And I was, another thing is there's so many skate parks now. That's right. Like, in, in the, in Same the, in my in city. This, in in this, Barcelona, they have more skate parks than uh, football fields. I grew up in the 70s when there was no skate parks. All of a sudden, I wore the very first skate park in the history of skateboarding in, in San Diego, Carlsbad. All of a sudden, there's like hundreds of parks across the world. And they closed them all after the 80s. So in No, so in the 70s. So the 80s, when I'm a ramp builder, there was no skateboard. We, we had to uh, jump the fences and ride the pools. So we helped rebuild skateboarding, you know, yeah. ma making ramps and making parks. And now there's thousands of parks across the world, which is, is a dream for us. It's a dream, man. We didn't it's have that. Dream. It's great that now the kids can skate the parks and become, you know, like we saw today, so much good skating. So that, that's our It's thing. Really high level. To right? give the kids a place to skate. To, yeah. But just still to, skating, right? Yeah, I love skateboarding, yeah. Always. I'm always, always. skate, yeah. Front side, yeah, yeah. yeah. Front side grind, style, just style, you know, from Fast the heart, as, you know. From the heart, man. But I was, as a kid, I was always hyperactive and always energy, you know. So put it on the wheels, and it's, yeah, it's the way to go. Like many kids today, like they love, you know. So if a kid has energy, put them on wheels, let them go, you know. So what's the next? What's the next stop for you in the World Cup? <laughs> wow, well, this this whole summer, uh, let me tell you where I just came from was uh, Prague, Czech Republic. We had a Mystic Skate Cup. Yeah, Czech was Republic. In June. After that, I went back home for Colorado. It was a big contest. Then uh, 4th of July and in California. Then moving to Montreal, Canada, World Cup. Then we had a big one in uh, 
San Jose is called Tim Brosh. Some guy died, like a good a professional skater died, Tim yep. Brosh. For 15 years, we're keeping his spirit alive in San Jose, which is like a big part of, of uh, like Thrasher Independent, like NorCal skateboarding. So that was like a couple weeks ago. Then we had, last weekend was in my hometown, Huntington Beach, Vans Invitational. They had a surf, US Open surfing. Yeah, US. The winner US won $100,000. And, and skate, you get a ticket from yeah, the cops, yeah, man. Yeah, the, the skateboard, yeah, I know. Police, my first Polish time. Polish in my bag all the time. The story but, yeah, of my yeah, life. Yeah. <laughs> but no, no, but the, the skateboard guy won 25000 which yeah. is good money. And this is my hometown, good, so I live one mile from the beach right there. My, all my friends from all over the world, just like this, by the ocean. So to come from there to here, it's like I feel home here, you know. The ocean, the skateboarding, the life, you know. And the good people, the people of Spain, I love them. And, you know, Alain Goicoche, the guy today, so much history of this guy on a World Cup tour. Yeah. Ivan Arvado, Daniel. You, you know, know all of them. Yeah, because know, they're, all the they're always on the tour, them. and I love with their spirit of, of Spain. They're carrying the torch for Spain everywhere. Those guys are the ones. We love you. We yeah, love you, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. And I know you Bar are part Barcelona, of the story of skateboarding. Barcelona is a big part of street skateboard history, you know. Yeah, that's right. For many, many years, everybody comes there for the lifestyle and the videos. I'm trying to... I respect the Spain, you know. As I told you, I, I have really good uh, relation with uh, Todd Hoover, yeah, the one from yeah, Simi yeah, Valley, let's, let's talk about Skateboard that. Museum. I mean, that, the Hall of so Fame, I'm huh? planning to have, because I'm a skateboard collector, I'm planning to have in, in Barcelona, which is in Spain, uh, the first skateboard museum. You should, you should. Dude, man, it's, 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 yeah. it's the part what I have, a, what, what I really have yeah. to do in my life, you know. I've been skating forever and I really want to build the first I, skateboard I museum in Spain. The, the, the crazy thing about Todd, you know, his story when he went to Florida, he saw like some like wake surf, like Hall of Fame or something like that crazy. Oh, really? What the what the hell is wake surf? Like whatever, like, oh, yeah? you know, cause it's big there. They have the cables and all the wake yeah. surf. And he's like, Hall of Fame, we don't have that for skateboarding. So in, in his mind, he saw this billboard, going, what the heck, we need this. That's, I heard the story, like that yeah. was what drove him to say, let's make a Hall of Fame for skateboarding, you know? And that's amazing that they do it, you know? It's I'm there every year with all the guys watching, the people I grew up watching in the magazines, the videos, and you know, to become, you know, like in the Hall of Fame, it's cool. So that's cool, you know, Todd, it's a lot of history there. Dude, man. It's his collection, he has in Simi Valley. Amazing. Like all the all the it boards. All, it's, that's good. it's also collecting yo-yos and latch yeah, yeah, boxes yeah, yeah, and yeah. everything. That's our life, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Some, someone's got to do it. <laughs> yeah. Dude, so, really, sorry, man. really I, I nice to, to have you this year I, I again. Wish, I, wish you, I, I wish you could be with me every day of my life. Like you, you would enjoy. Until you are full of love, and I, man. And I know, same with you, man. I would love to be with Honestly. you everywhere you go. This guy is the man. I love it. I love it. It's oh. nice to win our paths cross. That's right. Have a good time. So Thank I look you forward so nice to you coming to California. I'm happy to be here in Spain. Very nice to meet you. Thank you guys. Um, bueno, yeah. experience. Muchas gracias, España. Dave Duncan, una leyenda. Yeah.